Hi guys, today we're gonna make one really cool game from cardboard. Just for me! Ooh, I want Among Us! If you're telling me the truth, then I'm sure you can help me collect all your favorite scenes in one place. I already did, but um, something went wrong. How did you manage to get tangled in this? What a mystery. Sammy, could you please attach the other end of this to the paper roll? First, you need to apply the glue, and then you should do like this. Oop. It's done, Sue! Great! We'll come back to this later, guys. Yahoo! Sammy, you found another toy to play with, I see. <laughs> it's kind of fun, but we're going to use those for the craft. It is important not to forget about the safety. Glue gun is not a toy, guys. Sammy, did you know that Among Us has so much in common with another popular game, Mafia? So is it like Space Mafia? Right, and that even used to be the working title of the game. I'm glad they decided to change it. There we go. Do you have some problems with Mafia? Don't mess with Sammy, the cool slime with no fear! <laughs> <laughs> Sammy, I want world peace, so let me take this because I know what to do with it. I think it will look better here. Don't tell me I'll have to roll the pictures by myself. Of course not. All the work will be done by... A motor, am I right? Absolutely so you won't get tired. We need to secure this piece very well. So the game will stay safe if Sammy gets carried away. He's so competitive, you know, guys? Sue, look what I found. We can make characters from these things. Actually, I already know how to make them, but these pieces are just in time. You don't like any of my ideas today. That's not true, Sammy. Didn't you notice these openings? Um, sure. In that case, you understand. That's just not the right material. And there are no reasons to get grumpy. <laughs> I'm just starting to think you don't believe in me anymore, Sue. I'm going to prove you wrong, Sammy. We'll see. Let's continue our work, guys. As you can see, we've secured our system and... What's this? <laughs> Sammy, is this your doing? These rubber bands are just in time. But you should have let me explain everything to the guys. Why are you always so impatient? And here comes the second one. Great. Sue, I heard it's a good idea to grab a bite if you're boiling from within. Let me get you something. Thanks, but I'm not hungry. I could use these plates, though. One, two, three, it's fun should be. What a nice trick that was. Sue, really don't get mad. I'm just in a good mood because of this wonderful craft. I'll be in a good mood, too. If you figure out the characters and the decor. Wow, these look like two tiny burgers. Sammy, I said the decor. Okay, okay, I just can't seem to pass a good burger. Hmm, it came out that we're hiding two burgers inside the game. Like Easter eggs in the real game. <laughs> Guys, did you know there are lots of Easter eggs in Among Us? For example, there's but one of But we're them. not going to tell you all the secrets, otherwise it won't be fun to play. Don't you agree, guys? If you don't like spoilers either, give us a thumbs up. Sammy, how are the characters doing? Great! I'm almost done! That's great news! Whoosh! Hmm, what's this? Oh, Sue, do you need this too? Oh, okay. I guess he's got a new game in mind. <laughs> We're gonna move this rubber band and the character will jump here and there. And speaking of which, boop and boop. Sue, I've made one real cool character, but I, I, I lost him. Whoopsie! I searched everywhere, but I found nothing. <laughs> Sammy, is it a new version of hide and seek? Oh, that's where he was. What an imposter! Your place is here, little friend. And we're back with our craft. Be careful with the nails, guys. Sue, I was wondering, how will we control this thing? I'm just working on that. Try to guess what our craft and PlayStation 4 have in common. No way. A joystick? Bingo. <laughs> Sue, I want to make one. I played with a joystick so much, I'll make the best one. Of course, Sammy. I have no doubts about that. 
Oh, I adore when he's so happy. In the meantime, we need to connect all the systems with the wires. Poof, looks great. Everything should be in order, and the tape will help us here. There we go. Sue, what should I use to make the joystick? I suggest we make it from cardboard. Will this piece do? Sure, thank you, Sammy. First, we need to draw the outline of our joystick. In the meantime, I'm going to make several perfect buttons for it. Perfect. Here's what we got, guys. Care for some magic? Voila! Phew, it looks kind of too thin, don't you think? That's why we'll need several pieces like this one. We'll glue them together. That's genius! I finished the buttons and came to help you. Thank you, Sammy. You're so kind. Just imagine a space joystick. Have you ever seen anything like that? It will be the only one in the whole universe. Here you go, Sue. Let's finish it faster. If you say so. That's where hot glue is going to help us. Be careful working with it, guys. There, and press a little. Time to add the buttons and paint the joystick. Whoosh! Wow, it looks so realistic. Oh, and I love these buttons, so cool. All we need to do now is to put the battery and the electrical circuit in their places, just like this. Susie, and what will the next step be? Bring me another battery, please. Like this one? Yes, this one. As you already know, Sammy, the system is not going to work without power. We need to secure this battery well in order not to break the circuit. Can I test the whole system? Looks like it works like a charm. I think we need to connect the on-off button to you economize the battery. What do you think, Sue? That's a brilliant idea. But can you please speed it up a little? I can't wait to play! Anything for you to smile, my little slime. Wow. Guys, don't you think we need to cover the system? I'd like to concentrate on the game, not on the rolling details. I can hear that, Sammy. You could have just asked. This piece reminds me of a large gate. To the gamer's heaven! Here you go, Sue! <laughs> oh, Sammy, are you ready to test our game? I have been ready for years. And last but not least, the lid. Um, Sue, I, I can't see through the walls. You don't need to. Voila! I know a few tricks too, Sue. Close your eyes! No problem! Wow, you've even put an imposter here! Well, he's kind of the symbol of the game. And what are these for? Well, what if you need to change the batteries? I'm planning to play all night long today. No games after midnight, mister. Let's take a look at this wonderful craft again before Sammy takes it away. Guys, today I challenge Sam to beat me at a board game. A board game? You should have told me that in the very beginning. I can easily beat you, alias Monopoly, Jenga, or Mafia, for the millionth time. Just name it. Not so fast, Sammy. This board game will be pretty unusual. Be careful of the color, guys. First of all, we make it ourselves. And second of all, ta da! Cool, huh? <laughs> no, Sam. The main theme of our craft today will be the Among Us game. <gasps> That's totally cool. Guys, we've already made a few Among Us games and crafts. You can click around our channel to watch those videos. Ahem, I'm ready to assist. Um, you should cut them out. Hi, Roger, I know. In the meantime, I'll continue working with cardboard. 
This is where we'll attach our crewmates. Ahem, here's a crewmate for you, Raj. I thought you might need it right now. <laughs> oh, you're just in time, buddy. Guys, give Sam a thumbs up for his anticipation. <laughs> you see, we glued our crewmate on both sides of this piece. And now, check out what I've got, guys. These are small magnets. Today, they are an important part of our craft. We need to attach them... Oops. To attach... Ugh. Sam! Ah, Roger, you took the wrong tweezers. You need to use plastic ones for magnets. Oh, right. Don't forget about the glue. Like this. A couple of drops will be enough to secure it. Now we need to attach little aluminum plates over here. Oh, that's going to take a while. Ha! I'll do it in no time. Before you know it. Yeah? Well, go on. Wow, you really did it, Sammy. Yep, I'm a flashlight crafter. I bet it would take you ten years or so. <laughs> um, um, well, I sped up a little here too, you know. Ah, fine, we're even. Yep. Okay, guys, we've made our players. Let's call them that. And now, we need to make a mechanism that will help us identify the winner and the loser in our game. Uh, Roger, it's not that I doubt you're genius, but I still can't understand how this game will work. <laughs> well, Sam, I'll do my best to explain that to you. All right, do you know the game with matches where one of them is shorter than the others? And whoever pulls that one out usually loses? Huh? Sammy? Ah! Yeah, we once played it in Tibby Daba to decide who had to wash the dishes after a big party. I lost that time anyway. Ugh. So this game basically works on the same principle. Except that we won't use any matches here. The one who makes this flag pop out wins. That sounds awesome. Am I right, guys? Then give us a thumbs up. Now we'll take our clock face, as Sam calls it, and attach this flag mechanism right here, through this very opening. To make sure everything holds well, we'll add these supports. Great! Now we need to attach a few of these pieces opposite to these openings. I might need your help here. Sammy! I am fully at your service, Roger. Ahem. Crafticus, fixicus. Pieces at <laughs> wow, guys, check this out! Sam even put magnets in their places! Wonderful spell, buddy! Oh, <laughs> thank you. Hey, what is that? That's a very long strip of craft paper. We need to roll it like this to form the centerpiece for our craft. As you can see, we need one more roll. It's thinner and a bit longer than the first one. Let's put them together. Like this. Next, we're going to make a hole in this piece using a drill. Guys, you should definitely ask an adult to help you at this stage. <sighs> okay, this one is the switch button for our board game. Hmm, I think it should look brighter, Raj. All right. Is it better now, Sammy? Way better. <laughs> Guys, now watch really carefully because we're going to install this piece into the mechanism. This little, but very important piece, will hold the thread in the proper position. We put it right here, and pull it out from the other side of our craft. Then, we put the thread through the opening in our switch button, and crisscross to the rubber band. This way. And we can finally attach the button to the craft. Here is what we've got. Hey Raj, how can we be sure that everything works as it should? Good point, Sam. We need to put all of our players in their places. You see, these two magnets should match. Let's speed up a little. Whoa! So that is the underside of our craft? Yup. We secured the players with wooden sticks. And our next step will be to solder things up. Stay tuned! <laughs> Always work with it under an adult supervision. I trust Roger with this type of work. Okay, it's all done. All the pieces of our players are now connected in one circuit. 
All that's left to do is to connect everything to the motors. This is the second one. By the way, we're going to place it under the switch button. Right here. Uh, Roger, I made that round piece you asked for. Why do we need it? Ah, oh, very good, Sammy. This piece will actually rotate. And do you see this aluminum strip over here? As soon as one of our crewmate players hits this strip, the flag pops up, defining the winner. <gasps> no way, Raj! That sounds even cooler than I thought it would be! <laughs> Thanks, Sammy! Hmm. You know what? If you prove to me that everything here works as it should, I'll officially announce you as... The coolest friend ever! <laughs> <laughs> Sammy, I'd do that for you even without an honorable status. But since you suggested it... It's just that any mechanism requires some testing. Agree? Sure thing. Watch me. We press on any of the crewmates we want, in random order, until... Oh, the flag pops up. I proudly announce you the best friend in the world! We need to take a selfie together now! <laughs> Why don't we finish our craft first? Uh, okay... But as a good friend, I don't mind if you start eating Nutella without me. I mean, if you want. Yeah, and miss my favorite decoration stage? No way! <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Sam. There we go. Oh, down, buddy. Uh, Don't throw uh, things. <laughs> take this, too. Thanks, buddy. Uh, Roger, take it from here. Phew. Where's my Nutella? Take a breath, Sam. We're almost done with our craft. Ugh, just a little more. Ugh. Great. Let's just decorate the flag. Uh-huh. And make the whole thing look neat. Right, guys? There we go. The craft is ready! You can check it out for yourselves, guys! Hey, Sammy! Leave some Nutella for me! So, what do you say, Sammy? Are you ready to lose? <laughs> In your dreams, Roger! Let's get started! Oh. And I'll go with this one! Take that! <laughs> you take that! Do it once! Oh, Sam, just you wait! <gasps> Woo! I won! I won! I knew it! <laughs> yeah! What? Oh, come on! You have to learn how to lose! <laughs> Guys, I hope you love this craft. Try to make one at home and play with your friends. Bye! <laughs> Rock, paper, scissors! <laughs> uh, 